Cooker time in the Champions League. Four teams are left and the stage is set for an enthralling semi-final. Who will make it through to the showpiece event? It's Tottenham Hotspur. They face Arsenal live right here on EA TV. Good evening, everyone. A city that has so much to offer in so many respects, but of course on the football front as well. Hello from the English capital, London. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. And on the menu, action from Europe's Premier Club competition, the Champions League. This, the first leg of the semi-final. It is Tottenham Hotspur up against Arsenal. Well, Derek, it could be cagey and it could be tight, but we've got some of the best players on view here, and they'll want to show just how good they really are. I can't wait for this tie to start. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. But just like that, possession changes hands. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. And it will be an Arsenal free kick. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the focal point in attack is Gabriel Jesus. How about the cross? Looking for the right angle. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. This attack looks highly promising. Must take the lead here. And a goal! The opener in the semi-final. First goal of the contest. Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. Arsenal know they need to wipe out that last goal. Ben White. William Saliba. Rice with it. Havertz. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. An alert piece of defending. And the penalty has been given here. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty, yes, yellow card, no. Chance to even things up here. A goal! from the spot well as you can see from the replay the keeper tries to read the penalty but he's sent the wrong way and it ends up looking a very easy finish so back underway they've levelled it at 1-1 here Giovanni Lo Celso. He continues his run. Will he shoot? The fans hope so. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Jesus. Gabriel Jesus. It's with Erdogan. On to Jesus. 
and in a perfect position to cut it out. Saar. Now Son. Bentancourt. Good technique displayed, but really sticking to the task defensively. Martinelli. Alexander Zinchenko. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Well, let's revisit the penalty conversion, shall we? Declan Rice. What can they do from here? Martin Odegaard. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Well, that's a really top-notch piece of defending. No more time left. That is it for the first half here at the home of Tottenham. And the second half has started here at the home of Spurs. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half. Oh, hang on, Stuart. Big chance here. Lo Celso. Bentancourt with it. Giovanni Lo Celso. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Oh, could be. Oh, a vital piece of last ditch defending. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Hyung Min Son. Promising move from Tottenham. An alert intervention. And that's going to result in a goal kick. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Martinelli now Zinchenko he read the situation defensively and did his job Kulusevsky Well, these fans are driving their team on here, but can Tottenham find a winning goal? Not long left now. Saar. And on to Kurusevsky. Pedro Porro. Now Romero with it. Bentancourt. Saar. Son. Nice looking move, this. Now 
Oh, he must favour the cross. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Ten minutes left for play. Martinelli. There to take it away. Well, the fans are making so much noise here. They believe the winner's coming. But it needs a moment of inspiration for one of those players out on the pitch. What a finale we've got. Only five minutes left for play. And tension galore with the teams locked together. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Jorginho on to Jesus a very timely interception and forward go Arsenal do they have a late winning goal in the future and cleared away so one minute of stoppage time that's what the officials have said and there's the final whistle, a thoroughly entertaining semi-final first leg. And I must say, Stuart, it bodes well for the return match. Yeah, fantastic first 90 minutes, wasn't it? Exactly what you want to see at this stage of the competition. Let's just hope they can replicate that in the reverse fixture. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's put in a really authoritative performance here. Well, I think he'll be pleased with his overall performance. When they were struggling, he was the one to step up. And it's a key goal, that.